Can you judge a book by its cover? On the outside, you see an average cheerleader, but what's on the inside? Well, growing up, I really didn't know my mother. Yeah, because she, she did drugs, so I really didn't get to know her, but it kind of it feels awkward not to have a mother. Three freshmen students from Gary Como College Prep, 15-year-old Brianna Brown, her cousin Marquise Brown, 14, and 15-year-old Kimani Cannon all have something in common. Even though they are living without one or both of their biological parents, they are still successful in their work. Well, my aunt is one of the things that give, gives me encouragement because she always wants me to do my best and put my best forth, even though sometimes it don't like come out the way I want it to, but as long as I did my best, she'll know that that's what counts. Brianna also gets encouragement from someone special in her life. My grandma, she encourages me the most because she influenced me to you know, get up each and every day to go to school. Not only am I going to school, but she's going to school to take classes also um, on the computer for University of Phoenix. And she just keep, she keep me motivated. She keep me inspired to do better. All three of these teens have a different story to tell. My father was in and out of my life. And all that, like, I still see my father, but when he was in my life, really, he was abusive to my mother. So when he left, it was kind of a relief. He, like, left and in the middle of the night while we were asleep and never came back. Well, like when I come to school and to know that my friends say my mom did this, my dad did that, it you know it puts, kind of puts me down. But at the same time, I'm happy because I have a strong, intelligent black grandmother that influenced me. These teens are involved in different activities that also give them motivation. Kimani and Marquise both are involved in a journalism program at the Gary Comer Youth Center. I work at Free Spirit Media, and we consist of journalists and creative writing. And of course, Brianna takes pride in her cheerleading. Before school, we have cheerleading and um, after school cheerleading. These three teens have different views on child abandonment. I feel that child abandonment, you know, is wrong, but depending on how the person is, it sometimes can be the right thing. Because if my father was in my life right now, I doubt I would be the person I am today. I think that it's like a terrible thing because like, if people didn't want to have kids, then they shouldn't have, lay down with somebody else to have sex mm -hmm. to be, um, make their baby. And if they're not going to take care of it, that's not fair to that child. Do you feel the same way that Brianna does? I could, well, I have a question like, why abandon your child? You know, if you didn't want a child, why have one, you know? Because it, it, it actually hurts. It actually hurts not to have a mother or father.